All right, guys, we're back for another Dokkan Battle video, and this is going to be a global exclusive video. Now, not a global first, but this appears like this is going to be a global exclusive because we're going to do some shenanigans with the Pilaf Trove here. So, you know, it's very clear they're going to do a lot more global first stuff coming up. You know, your boy is going to need to make sure I've got this global account uh, ready to go. Now, Again, I, I do want to point out, this is not a burner account or anything like that. This account, this 1,000-day Goku, this is a legitimate account. That's like 1,400 days plus or something like that. Like, this account has hundreds of days more than my JP main does. So, um, I, I, I just do just want to build it up a little bit. And I thought a really good way to do that would be, again, to explore Pilaf's Trove. So, we're going to do a number of summons, and we're going to buy a bunch of these packs from Pilaf's Trove and sort of take a look at how good some of them are going to be. So we're going to do some summons on the Super Saiyan 3 Goku and Majin Vegeta um, banners here because um, we're going to get these ticket packs and sort of see how that's going to work. Um, and then I also am going to get some tickets down here because I want to take a look at this right here, this SSR Force banner as well as the Hercules Fortune banner. Um, now, I, I was looking. There are also these tickets in here, but I believe a lot of, like, like, I don't know why this is just still here. Like, I get, does, is this just permanent or what? Because... Like, some of these tickets, I was looking, and it didn't look like they were actually in the Pilafs Trove. Like, this yellow beginner's ticket right here, so this is just permanently sitting there forever on Global. It's just very bizarre, right? Like, I, I don't really know why they're doing that, but sure, sure. So, let's go ahead and head over to the Pilaf Trove. Um, I did pick up some Google Play credit. The one good thing about me maintaining a Global account is that when I buy stones on JP, it gives me these Google Play points. Like, it, it works, and I can only use them for global, right? But when I buy stones on global or JP, I get the points, but I can only actually use them on global. So, like, right now, I've got, like, I don't know, 100 bucks in Google Play credit or whatever. So, let's go all the way to the right. Beginner's pack. Let's take a look at this. Okay. So, we'll get one of these tickets. 15 stones some Kai's. I mean, this account needs, uh, like, medals, training items, everything. So, this is all actually pretty useful here. Let's go ahead and pick up this pack, and uh, this shouldn't show any... Yep, okay, cool. All, all this is going to show is the Google Play balance that we've got to work with, so I don't have to make a cut right here. You know, I don't want to, uh, you know, give away any info I shouldn't, right? <laughs> and there's those Google Play points right there. Okay, so they went to the gift box. That's cool. We'll, we'll, um, we'll leave it there for now. And then we'll take a look at uh, everything we're going to work with after this. Okay, so now we got all these power-up packs, huh? Uh, so let me see here. Just metals? Some shells, which are nice. Psst, okay. That's... <laughs> whatever. Uh, and then we got this mysterious pack right here. 100 incredible gems is nice. This account needs Zenny bad. And then also, Hercule Fortune Summon Ticket. Let's go and grab one of these. Uh, looks like you could buy that three times. I think we're just going to get it the once, but I mean, I guess it is interesting you can get it several times like that. Oh, this resets. Interesting. Oh, wow. They they really... <laughs> they really allowed it on Global to be monetized heavily, right? So these reset, like, weekly, and it's packs to get you, like, Awakening Medals, and then this one is Zenny right here. This just gives you a shit ton of Zenny. So, like, you know, if you are a lazy whale on Global, you could just buy a ton of this stuff. Interesting. Okay. So, now I'll head to the Hidden Potential. I think I'm going to avoid these for now. Wow. Oh, my God. Goresh was not lying that these were overpriced. Uh, that's that's quite... 20 bucks? It's not even a path, dude. <laughs> the Gravity Chambers are nice. I love that they're, they give you Baba points. We're going to avoid that. All right, some rank up packs. Uh, let's take a look here. So there's the SSR tickets. Um, a bunch of, again, medals, Z swords. I could use all that. Some more Zenny and that SSR summon ticket. Let's go ahead and grab that. All right, we still got 121 bucks to work with. So, see, th okay. What I did was, um, right now, it's four times Google Play points. I thought it was only supposed to last until the 24th, but apparently it's still up. Um, so, you know, I... Like, I stocked up on JP. I was like, oh, during this weekend, it's four times points. So I bought, like, uh, 7,000 stones on JP or something like that to give me a lot of um, points to work with. So, you know, that's what that's another reason we're doing this here. Okay, so the rank 20 pack, Zenny. Now, nah, this is, we're going to skip. Yeah, we're going to skip that one. Twenty. The rank 20 pack is kind of booty cheeks right there. Rank 30 pack. You get a Kai, which is cool, but again, this is cheeks. Yeah, we're skipping that. 
Alright, the rank 50 pack. Ooh, orbs. Alright, so we get another one of those SSR Force tickets um, and some orbs. Not bad. Orbs are always good. We'll go ahead and grab that. Let's grab the rank 50 growth pack. Uh, looks like I am going to have to make a cut because I do want to clean out all of the steps of the um, the Dokkan Fest pack for the Vegeta and Goku. So I will spend a little bit of money here, but it's not really going to be a big deal. Um, okay, so then we have the rank 75 pack. Oh, character slots. <clears throat> Man, and 50 gems too. I'm going to skip this, but uh, I do like my character slots. That's nice. Okay, rank 100 pack. We'll grab this because it's going to give us another one of those tickets. Um, and then a bunch of orbs. Uh, you know, the orbs are nice. Looks like you can only get these one time as well, right? Like, this is only a one-time purchase here. Uh, probably once you hit that rank, you can actually buy it. It's interesting. Again, they're monetizing everything on Global, huh? <laughs> All right, rank 125. Oh, wow, another 25 character slots. I'm jelly, man. I wish we could get that on JP. I'd love the extra slots. All right, so rank 150 pack now. Um, again, Elder Kai, a ticket... A bunch of orbs and a bunch of medals and stuff like that. We'll take it all. Let's go ahead and grab that. The rank 150 pack. We're getting a little bit lower on the <laughs> on the Google Play funds too. So, you know, again, I can't ex can't be exposing critical info, so I'll probably have to cut uh, 24. Okay, so turtle shells. Mm, yeah, see some... We have the rank 200, and then these are just permanently sold out. Okay, so we'll get the rank 200 pack as well. Another ticket. Um, Elder Kai is cool. Diamond statue. A bunch of orbs. I mean, some of the, these are actually kind of useful. 500 trade points. Yeah, very, very needed. Okay, we still have enough Google Play balance to work with. Okay, I was, I was prepared to cut right there in case it showed too much, right? <laughs> all right, so we got all of the rank up packs that I cared to buy, right? Uh, we got a bunch of those SSR Force tickets. So we'll go ahead and we're going to use those. I did pick up the daily capsule. I mean, you know, this is pretty cool, right? Uh, I believe it shows you. Yeah, so like every day you get three... So yeah, so you get five stones right there, and then it's three stones per day. I mean, that's it's actually a good deal, that daily capsule. Like, I, I actually do sort of like that. Like, I think that's a very nice thing that Google's got to work with right there. All right, so now we get to this. This is one of the big ones, right? The global exclusive tickets. So I believe you could buy these packs, and then the second tier opens up, so it's... Can I see the details in all of them? Okay, so a couple tickets. Uh, a bunch of... Uh, okay, okay. A bunch of medals and stuff like that. What is this? Okay, we can actually see all the different tiers. So this gives you seven. Keys and meat. Oh, that's not fair. Oh, JP Shaft again, dude. Are you kidding me? Let's take a look at number three here. Premium. Okay, that's that's guaranteed, right? Um, Zenny Statue. Beerus Planet. More meat. Wow, man. JP Shaft again. Okay, whatever. I'm going to go ahead and... I think I'm just going to buy all these. <laughs> We're going to go ahead and... You can get them two times each. The bottom ones you can. I think I'm just going to... I'm going to get... Um, I'm going to get the, the pack one of each. I'm going to get the pack two of each. And then I'm going to get one of the pack threes for each. I'm not going to get both, but I'll get one of them. And I believe you do have to actually... So, like, okay. So, let me just buy this one. The Goku pack one. And then this should unlock the Goku Pack 2, and then you can sort of keep going like that. Um, but they have created a very clever monetization system here on Global, huh? Yeah, they're like, hey, come on down. <laughs> Spend all the money you desire. Oh, good. All right, well, <laughs> sure. Let me go ahead and cut. We'll, I'll, I'll pick up some of these packs, and we'll come back. All right, guys, so we are back. Um, again, I picked up one of the two. I, I don't need to go super crazy here and completely clear it out. Um, I just wanted to get up to that third level one so we can get the premium summon ticket and go ahead and test it out. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at... The, well, 99 plus. All right, let's take a look at the spoils of war we have here from the Pilaf's Trove pack right here. Um, okay, so we got a lot of Zenny. We've got, again, a ton of tickets. Uh, we got some meat, some keys, a good amount of orbs, uh, just a bunch of overall supplies. Oh, dude, there's a lot of stuff in here. Jeez. <laughs> Uh, okay, so it looks like we definitely got, like, enough orbs almost to, like, rainbow a uh, unit of every typing. Just tons of supplies right here. So, a good way to beef up an account, for sure. Um, but no stones in there. That's nice. Okay. So, the number one thing I want to do is I want to take a look at these. Um, so, we got a ticket right here. Okay, I'm actually... Let me take a look 
at what unit we want to grab with this. Probably Gogeta. I want to make sure. I want to see which one of these uh, units this account does and does not have. I probably will go with Gogeta, but let me make sure um, to get the correct character here. All right, guys. So I think we've narrowed it down to the unit that we definitely want to go ahead and grab here, and it's going to be Int Janemba. Um, Gogeta is actually already rainbowed here, um, so we don't even have to worry about him. So that's good. We'll go ahead and grab Int Janemba. Um, with the beginner ticket right here. That's that's actually worth it. Uh, Int Geneva is super good. So, again, if you're a player, maybe you do want to put a little bit of money into the game. Like, this one was actually kind of worth it to get, like, a, like a copy of Geneva. Like, if you're a new player, and I never recommend spending a lot of money in these games, right? Like, you are much better off being free to play. But what was that? Ten bucks? If you're able to get Geneva 15 stones? Eh... I don't know. Is that really worth it? Is Janemba really worth 10 bucks right there, plus 15 stones and a couple of Kai's? Probably not. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm, I'm just crazy. Uh, <laughs> all right, so we went ahead and we grabbed that Janemba. That's cool. So now we got a bunch of tickets to work through. Okay, so these are the premium tickets, right? One featured SSR character guaranteed for a multi. So, uh, sure, let's just jump in. Uh, let's jump in. So we're on the Goku banner right here. Uh, this account does actually already have Goku. Goku is on this account, um, the Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Um, we don't have Majin Vegeta, so we'll take Majin Vegeta. I know we do have LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku, but obviously I'll, I'll take him. <laughs> I'll... Okay, that doesn't mean anything. That because that's just uh, that means that the guaranteed SSR is not Great Saiyan Man. That's what that means. Um, double screen crack because it could be a Dokkan Fest exclusive, right? Okay, I mean, that's not... <laughs> Thanks. That's, I, it doesn't matter. That's not the, the actual big-time character we're going to get right here. <laughs> Wait, that's not new unit 10. I don't think that was the guaranteed one either. Oh, wow. How nice. That's worth 30 bucks. <laughs> All right, let me double-check how we're doing with those two units. Okay, so Blue Kaioken Goku... That's usable. Okay, so I'm, I guess I won't be too salty there. And how about Angel Super Saiyan 3 Goku? Also actually usable. So, okay. I mean, that's not what we wanted. But at the very least, um, it was not, like, like it was not worthless, right? So, sure. Whatever. But, you know, we're, we're using... We're, this is, a again, a global exclusive summon video right here. These are summons that you can't do on JP. All right. Blue? No. Okay. Um, I did not see Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta on this account. I, I, again, I, anything we pull, I do just sort of want to double check again. I'm, I'm trying my best to build this account up. Um, you know, get it ready you know, for more global first in the future. And I probably will do some uh, content on EGL Rose when he drops. Uh, so we will see. Um, I'd love Majin Vegeta since this account does not have him. So for sure, we'll take him. Okay. Okay. Transforming Vegeta. This is not great. Um, okay. I, again, I, I am unfamiliar if this account's even got him. Yeah, we do. Um, that's a second dupe. I mean, wow. Well, you know, wh what a what a difference for me, right? Like, we're doing all these summons, and I'm pulling these. It's like, oh, good. Transforming Vegeta. And it's like, oh, well, I could actually use him. <laughs> okay. Uh, and we got some more tickets here. Yeah. So we'll go ahead and we'll do what We get another ticket multi, basically, for free. Uh, well, not for free. Oh! <laughs> Hello! Well, uh, that's a dupe for Super Saiyan 3 Goku. We'll take that. We will definitely take that. <laughs> Alright, well. Um, <laughs> that's a W for sure. You know, now, what's really funny is... again. Hello, my friend. Um, he shafted me really badly on JP. So, nice of him to appear like that. Um, I do appreciate that. How, how much was that, the three packs? Because, what, was it 32, 10, and, like, three or something like that? I think it, it's something like that. Um, we got Topo as well. I mean, if Topo's not Rainbow, that's actually pretty good. Um, I, I guess we'll just do this single as well. Why, I mean, there's no re Like, people ask, like, oh, should I use my tickets? Should I save them? Like, use them. Like, look, these tickets don't carry over to other banners. You, ha you have to use it right away, right? All right, so we'll go ahead and pop this. Um, and then we'll move on to uh, Majin Vegeta's banner. Um, you know, I would have obviously preferred to have gotten that Goku Black Rift on Majin Vegeta, but um, I'm not going to complain at getting, you know, the newest Dokkan Fest exclusive unit, basically, um, here on Global. Yeah, no Goku Black Rift here. That's okay. Um, oh, boy. Just Gohan. Is this guaranteed? 
Does have a guaranteed SSR at the end? I believe it does, right? These global ticket banners do have the guaranteed SSR. Because these are the banner... Okay, so that's one. Give me a second. No. Um, I believe these banners are guaranteed SSR at the end. Um, and, you know, you can get these tickets just by... So you can get them for free just by summoning on the banner while the discounts are up. I think the discounts aren't up anymore. So, like, we're, we're not going to actually go into the stone version of these banners. But, um, you know, we're, we're just knocking this out right here. Blah, 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 blah. Chow man! Whoa! That's worth it. That was worth the price of admission right there. Chow man! Yeah! Woo! Man! My boy! Chow man! Ho! Oh, yeah, you are fun. All right, so let's go ahead and do this. Uh, base form, so we're probably going to pull a rare or an SR, but... I mean, I guess we did, we did get through... We got, th what? We got, what? Four Dokkan Fest exclusives, Transforming Vegeta, Blue Kaioken Goku, Angel Super Saiyan 3 Goku, and the Int Super Saiyan 3 Goku. All of them we could use, so it wasn't that bad. All right, so now, uh, so what is this? This is just Hercule statues, gold, platinum, and then diamond. Sure, let, let's knock this out. So this is going to give us a multi of Hercule statues. I mean, this account does need Zenny, so I'm not too salty about this. Uh, you know, we'll take it, I, I guess, <laughs> you know. This is so goofy. I really wish all this was on JP, man. I, I do, I do. Because some of this stuff, like, I play around with. Okay, well, we got platinum, sure. Just as long as we don't get gold. Platinum is good. Give me a diamond. There's gold. Platinum. We're not going to get a diamond, huh? Yeah. Wow, shafted on the Hercule statue banner. Unbelievable. All right, so now we get the SSR for summon. We have really have to do singles here? Okay. All right, so the family Kamehameha units, all three are rainbowed in this count. We can't use them. Go tanks, Golden Frieza, Goku Cell. I know Cell is not rainbowed. Gohan, Gogeta. We don't want to pull Gogeta. Gogeta's rainbowed here. Okay. Uh, Super Vegito is not. Cell, Goku Black, Vegito Rose. Let me take a look. Hold on, Vegito Blue, Rose, and then this Goku Black. Those three. Um, let me take a look at those three real quick. Okay, so Goku Black is not even here. Oh wow. We want Goku Black for sure, then, because he's amazing on Global, right? Okay, let me take a look at Rosé, who's about to get his EZA. Oh, we got him rainbowed. Nice. Oh, oh mm. Ooh, that's beautiful. Ready for his EZA. We love that. Um, now, let's check Vegito Blue. Oh, we'll... Oh, we'll take a Vegito Blue. Oh, yeah, we will. All right, so let's go ahead and see. So, no Gogeta. We want, honestly, uh, the physical base form Goku Black. That's who we want. Uh, because, like, for, like, LR Rosé, you know, who knows? I, I probably, I will do some, oh! Well, I guess this doesn't matter. No, actually, this is fine. They're not all Dokkan Fest exclusives. So, this means we're not gonna get, like, the family Kamehameha units right here. So, this is fine. This is fine. Broly. Um, I mean, I don't really care. Dude, the last, it's been, like, years since I've used that Broly. Even Easy Aid, uh, I, you know, I just never find myself using him. So, I don't... That's not really too good, but whatever. I mean, could be worse, right? Easily could be worse. So, oh! All right, so this means we're not going to get the Family Kamehameha, which is good. Long Kamehameha is uh, exclusive. Okay, fake out. Buhan. I don't know. Uh, let me check Buhan and Broly, because, again, I, some of these units, I'm not too sure how we're looking here. Uh, th this gives you guys a good look at the account, how we're, we're dealing with. Uh, Buhan's not even awakened. Um... Okay, so we need a couple of dupes left for Buhan. That's fine. I'm, I'm okay with that pull, then. How about Broly? Yeah, no dupes. Okay, I mean, these pulls are all good. I mean, this, this is all stuff that could be used, right? So, hard to complain when this is all stuff we can actually use. I'm not crying at all about this. Um, I guess, I mean, because, I, right, I very easily could have, like, bought all those Pilaf Trove packs, and we could have pulled, like, nothing from the Super Saiyan 3 Goku banner and Vegeta banner, just pulled, like, garbage. And then we could have pulled just, like, the Family Kamehameha trio over and over right here, even though they're already rainbowed. You know, and it's like, oh, well, that's a nice waste of money. Oh, yeah, exactly like that, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but at, we at least got a bunch of units we could use, including Super Saiyan 3 Goku, so um, hard to be upset about that. All right, go on and pick a I mean, this, these animations don't matter, besides if it's, like, Vegito or something just means we're not going to get the family coming in the hat trio. Um, but there's a, there's so many featured units. It's, you know, whatever. All right, and we get Gotenks. Uh, I don't know. I, di I didn't look at how we are on that Gotenks. I mean, if we don't have them rainbowed, then that's a good pull. I'll take that. That Gotenks is good. 
So I, I don't I don't mind that at all. All right, here we go. That's cool. Um, we'll take that. All right, again, physical Goku Black or physical Vegito Blue. AGL Super Vegito would be okay as well. Um, those are the ones I'd like to pull right here. Yeah. Ah, that's good. Uh, not bad. I'm pretty happy with that, actually. That's pretty good. Uh, I will take that. Not bad. All right, so there we go. There. This was kind of a fun video. This, this was kind of... <laughs> this is actually pretty fun. Um, all right, let me take a look here. Let, let's, let's see what we're walking out of here with. So... Yeah, we got some okay units there. Again, a lot of these guys we could use. Let me check that Gotenks, actually. Um, let's see. Oh, he's Rainbows. So that's 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 garbage then. Okay. But we did get some good units. So let me know what you guys think uh, You know, of, of these global exclusive summons right here, right? I could go get another premium ticket for the Vegeta and Goku banner, but I think just one was fine. I mean, we did get ourselves the Goku. Um, some of the stuff is pretty good, like the Daily Capsule. Again, I didn't mind grabbing some of these rank packs. I mean, we got a, a lot of orbs. You know, we got some guaranteed, um, you know, SSRs. You know, we did get Physical Goku Black, who's way better on Global, so that was cool. These are a scam, absolutely. And this is probably one reason that they won't uh, update the Global uh, Orb event to match JPs, by the way, as well, is because of these scam packs right here. Um, these power-up packs, I mean, I mean, these reset. I mean, you, you don't want to touch these. I picked this up just so we could do the Hercule Summon. Um, but that I obviously don't recommend grabbing these. I mean, these don't even have stones in them. Like, you know, if they had, like, a little bit of stones at least, sure, but nothing. It, garbage. Um, and then the beginner's pack was okay, I guess. 15 stones. We got the ticket, which is okay. Um, I assume this is rotated out occasionally, just based upon the fact that there's, like, these th three different versions in here of it, right? And I don't understand why they don't clear out the old ones since you can't get the tickets anymore. That's a little bit bizarre. Uh, you know, I don't, don't really understand that, but whatever. Um, sorry. Let me know what you guys think. You know, Global does have a lot going on for it these days. Um, there was a Global exclusive summoning video. <laughs> and I'll catch you guys next time.